Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Chrisman XMNN and for today's video, we will be unboxing and reviewing the Xiaomi Mi 11 and as usual, shoutouts will be towards the end of this video. I purchased this one from Heijo Gadget Cebu and luckily it came with a gun charger 55 watts. This is the box and it's thin. It has gold fonts and also at the sides of the box. And it says here 108 megapixel AI Super Camera, Super AMOLED display, HDR10 Plus, and sound by Harman Kardon. The variant I have is the 8 gig RAM and 128 gig of internal storage UFS 3.1. Opening the box, you will be greeted with a small box which contains the SIM ejector tool, quick guide, and a jelly case next is the phone and there's no charging cable and now let's unbox the free charger which is the GAN fast charger 55 watts GAN stands for gallium nitride the advantage of having this type of charger is smaller in size more efficient in transferring current which means less energy is lost to heat so more energy goes to whatever you're trying to charge basically you can save some money on your electricity bill though it's small it's heavy also in the charger box it comes with the USB Type-C charging cable and the manual. Now the phone. I have the midnight gray color. It has a slim body, metal frame, and the phone is protected by Gorilla Glass Victus at the front and back. It has three cameras at the back. The bigger lens is the 108 megapixel camera. The other one is the 13 megapixel ultra wide, and the smaller one is the 5 megapixel macro lens. The phone has 20 megapixel punch hole selfie camera at the upper left corner of the screen. The cameras at the back can record videos up to 8K resolution at 24 frames and 30 frames per second, 4K resolution at 30 and 60 frames per second, 1080p at 30, 60, 120, 240, and 480 frames per second. It has optical image stabilization and gyro electronic image stabilization. The selfie camera can record 1080p at 30 and 60 frames per second and 720p at 30 frames per second with electronic image stabilization. Here are the sample videos and pictures captured using this phone. Now I'm vlogging using the front facing camera of the Xiaomi Mi 11. So how does it sound like guys and how is the stabilization during the night? And currently I am here at Cebu City, Philippines, currently at ID Park. Now using the camera at the back and how's the stabilization? How's the sound? Is it shaky? So I'm here at ID Park Cebu and we're shooting during the night. Now I'm vlogging using the front facing camera of the Xiaomi Mi 11. Let me know in the comment section below guys how is the stabilization and the audio. Now I'm using the back camera of the phone and by the way guys, I purchased this one from Heijo Gadget Store here in Cebu. So this is their store. And how's the stabilization guys? And let me know at the comment section below.
the back of the phone is frosted Gorilla Glass Victus which doesn't attract fingerprints that much. At the top of the phone, we have the sound by Harman Kardon branding, one of the dual speakers, microphone, and IR blaster. At the bottom, we have the dual SIM card tray, Type-C charging port, and one of the dual stereo speakers. At the right side, we have the volume buttons and below it is a power button and none at the left side. The fingerprint is located on display. It's fast but not the fastest. The display is an AMOLED screen with 1 billion colors, 120Hz refresh rate, HDR10+, and 1500 nits peak brightness. The size of the screen is 6.81 inch with 2K resolution. Lastly, it has 515 pixel per inch and curve at all angles. This phone has dual stereo speakers tuned by Harman Kardon. Let's listen to this music. Sick. The processor inside of this phone is the flagship Snapdragon 888 and Xiaomi Mi 11 is the first phone to have it available commercially. The phone comes with 8 to 12 gigs of RAM, 128 to 256 gigs of internal storage UFS 3.1. And now let's run an Antutu benchmark test of this device and by the way, I have added the Antutu benchmark app in Game Turbo. Xiaomi Mi 11 scored 641,101 and comparing it to Xiaomi Mi 10T, it's more of a 8 to 10% increase in terms of score. Here are some mobile gameplay using this phone. This phone has 4600 mAh battery which can last whole day for medium to light usage. The phone is capable of 55W fast charging, 50W fast wireless charging, 10W reverse wireless charging. In terms of charging using the GAN 55W fast charger, it can charge the phone from 5% to 20% in 5 minutes, in 30 minutes from 5% to 69%, and fully charged in 55 minutes. I'm really liking this phone. It's fast 
fast, takes good pictures and videos, and it can run high-intensive mobile games. Now, the price that I purchased this phone is at 37,990 pesos or $790 for 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of internal storage. Let me know at the comment section below what's your thought about the Xiaomi Mi 11. Peace. Shout out to Clarence Johnson, Asto Dilius, Chad Clark de los Santos, Epoico, Senpai Tutorial Series, Shens Wounded, Joker Onrada, Inigo Brizo, Idris Jewel, Aldrin Legaspi.